Hello and welcome to my channel. I really appreciate that you spend time to watch my videos. I haven't been uploading any videos for a while, but sometimes life happens and disrupts what you love to do. But now I'm back and ready to make some videos. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to my channel. That really helped my channel to grow. Today's turning is a small cherry log. I will turn it to my first ever turned Christmas tree. I hope you will enjoy the video as much as I enjoyed the turning. At this point I'm just trying to turn the log round so I can start making the shape for the Christmas tree. At this point I will start to establish the tenon. The tool I'm using is a new tool I just got. It was sponsored to me by the wood turning shop in Denmark. It's a TDB silver line tool and it's a 5mm parting tool. The silver line tool is hardened to 65 to 66 HRC Rockwell, which is comparable to a M42 HSS steel tool. So it's very sharp and it holds the edge very good. I've been using this tool for a little while and I must say compared to the other one I have, which is a Hamlet tool, it holds the edge way longer and is much sharper. If you want to see the rest of the Silverline series, you can follow the link to the shop in the video description. As you can see here, spindle turning is not something I do a lot. Mostly I'm turning bowls, but uh, I'm trying to learn it. The bowl gauss was not the optimal tool for this, at least not for me, so I decided to change the roughing gauss and that went a lot smoother and maybe I should just use this from the beginning. Thank you. 
Time to establish the foot of the tree. And again, I'm using the silver line, five millimeters parting tool. I sanded the tree from grid 120 to grid 240. And after that I made the decoration of the tree with a 3mm parting tool and made some uh, lines in the tree from the lowest part to the top part of the tree. After making all the lines, I gave it a spin with the sandpaper again to make a smooth surface and round off the edges of the lines a little. I liked the look of the tree, so I decided not to do anything further to it, no oil or wax or anything. Just doing the final shape of the base of the tree and then it's time to part off the tree from the rest of the log. Thank you very much for watching my video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider subscribing to my channel, give the video a like and a comment that will greatly help my channel to grow. Have a nice day and stay safe out there.